Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am in Miami. I flew in last night after Governor Cuomo announced that we're gonna be in quarantine for another month. I was like, I'm leaving, bye. Today I'm at a coronavirus testing center. My mom wanted me to get tested just in case since I just came from a hot spot, which is New York. Um, and the governor is pretty strict about that here in Florida. So I had to sign um, a paper that I would quarantine description of my trip. If I have a return flight, the address of where I'm going. You know, they were interrogating some people when I got to the airport. There was military waiting for us. When we walked out, it was like paparazzi. Like they were attacking us. Wouldn't let anyone go through. But I, I got out. They had pens. So I signed mine really quick. I gave it to them and they didn't even talk to me. But everyone else they were like harassing but luckily like i was like sh i'm short so i just like stuck it in the guy's like face i was like here and i left um so they didn't ask me anything but anyways i'm quarantining at my house and then anyway so they have drive through testing centers all around miami so i'm not selfish i'm not gonna put my parents and sister at risk especially since there's like 300,000 people in new york that are sick so I came here and just to make her happy. So let's see how it goes. I'm kind of nervous because like I still have to make contact with the fucking people that are doing the test, but they're covered head to toe, like face shields, all that. And you don't get out of the car. So they're just gonna stick their hands in the window like that. And then I, they'll stick whatever in my mouth to test. I just hope it's fast. Cause like I want to get out of fucking quarantine already. So. Let's see how I'm gonna record this, but I hope they're not like, why the fuck are you recording? But I really wanna show you guys, so it's kinda scary for me, fuck. Okay, I'm like gonna go up soon, so let's see. Hello everyone, this is part two to testing for coronavirus. Today we have an EMT coming by that works for my aunt who's a doctor and testing us with the antibody blood test to see if we, us three, have it. And we're also going to do an immune booster IV just to help us out a little bit with our immune system so we don't catch anything. Um, so let's see how it goes. And also, my mom is feeling a little sick, so we're concerned. But let's see, and we'll figure it out, and I'll show you how the test is. Okay, so he got here, and we're going to do it. I'm super nervous. Going in. Is it okay if I take a video? Okay. <laughs> I'm not in uniform, so good. <laughs> okay, so my mom is going first. Yeah, waiting on uh, two more people. Matt and Gabby. Matt should be joining soon. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. You're freaking out. Oh my god. Don't look, don't look. Don't look. Ah! That's it. That's it. That wasn't bad, right? No. You see? Still. I don't know why the finger thing always kills me. Hey, Matt, we're, we're on. Blood coming out. Yeah. You can squeeze from the bottom, yeah. There we go. That's right. Okay. Here. Just in case? Yeah. Test it off. Sorry. Oh sorry. Not even. <laughs> okay. Very good. So what happens now? 
we just wait 10 minutes to see what results we get to see if we're negative positive or if we had it before Sun. Yeah. And either you currently have it or you I'm bleeding. Or you had it before. I'll give it to you. So either tells you if you currently have it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you if you currently have it. So okay, so this thing tells you if you currently have it, if you had it, and mm -hmm. if you don't and if you don't have it, right. yes. Cool. So let me look at so which one says what? Like I agree, so you got the C for control, which is always mm -hmm. gonna light up. This is the one that tells you if you had it before, mm -hmm. or if you currently have it, and like you're getting over it, mm -hmm. and this is the one that says you didn't have it. Okay, now I'm doing an IV with nutrients and minerals, and I feel good. I already feel revived a little bit, healthy. I already feel the liquid in my arm. So there's a lot of nutrients and minerals. So it looks like that, and then we hooked it up there. And my mom's doing it too. So we waited 10 minutes. We, me and my mother, well actually this one's mine. I got control and she got control, which means we do not have it. We never had it. Okay, so we just finished. And as I mentioned, we are all negative. Me, my mom, my dad, and my sister. And then me and my mom did an immune IV booster. And she did an extra booster after the IV. So I was super nervous. The exam is from PharmaTech and it's one of the tests that is FDA approved. Um, so basically, like I said, they prick my finger, um, like I showed you guys, prick my finger, kind of get the blood with a pipette, then put the blood on the exam and then it shows whether you have it currently or, or you had it or you don't have it at all. So, thank goodness, both my nasal swab and the blood antibody test were negative. I was nervous about that because I came from a coronavirus hotspot, New York, and I didn't want to infect my family. And as I mentioned, my mom was feeling super sick all of a sudden yesterday, so we all freaked out and we were worried for her. So, this rapid antibody test is really good. It tells you immediately um within 10 minutes so we're all good thank goodness um and that's it so if you guys have any questions about how the tests work please write your questions below or if you have any comments i would be happy to answer your questions thank you for watching again with my little covid testing journey it was a little scary and made me anxious because i've already been so anxious with the media and stay tuned and do not forget to hit subscribe below hit that bell for notifications and see you guys next time